in your tech today, this is something I think is really cool. Uh, so, you know, we all know Mario Kart. Most of us have played Mario Kart, right? Uh, one of my favorite video games of all time, no question about that. But what if you took a real RC car? like this one right here, and you blended a camera on the top of the car with a video game and created kind of a, a, an augmented reality video game. It's called Mario Kart Live. If you look right now, oh, pop back up on camera for a second. I want to hold this up for you guys. So this is right now, you can see my face on the screen because that camera on the cart is what you use to actually play the game. Now we can show the video because here's how it works. You set up the four cardboard gates in your home, creating a track for the car. The game on the Nintendo Switch will learn the course and then turn it into a classic Mario Kart course. You use the Switch to drive the car. The camera on the cart is transmitted to your screen and it adds other racers, bonuses, all the classic Mario Kart elements. Now before I set it up, I thought it would be hard to control. I thought it would be glitchy. I thought how could this possibly be as fun as the normal Mario Kart game? I was so wrong. It is easy to control. Feels like Mario Kart. You just happen to be driving a real cart and your backdrop happens to be your home. My kids picked it up in a matter of minutes. Uh, I even have it set up here in the studio. If you guys want to pop back out live here and I can show you, this is what I've been doing all morning. In case you've been wondering how hard I've been working, not very hard. <laughs> and, uh, but yeah, I mean, this is it. And what I was surprised is that the car actually goes very slow in real life, right? Which, which seems weird, but on the game, it feels perfectly sped up, the perfect speed. It's exactly what you would expect with Mario Kart. Uh, you get all the bonuses, the shells, the mushrooms, they're all still there, just like you're used to. You can play up to four people at once, but here's a little bit of a catch. Everyone has to have one of these cars and a Nintendo Switch. So four people would require four cars, four Nintendo Switches, uh, yeah, and some people, you know, this may not be for everybody. Some people are going to want the simplicity of just a normal game. But if you're looking for a fun, different, interactive way to kind of up your Mario Kart game, I, I was excited about this. Honestly, it's cooler than I, than I thought it was going to be. Easy to set up, easy to play. Not really inexpensive, though. $100 per cart, which does include all the kind of cardboard elements you have to set up. Um, but I think it's cool. I've got my full review, my full write-up. A couple other things I might change online right now, kdvr.com. Just click into the technology section. But, you know, again, if your kids like Mario Kart, and you, you wouldn't mind them having maybe some like actual creativity to go along yeah, with it. Yeah, for sure. Because they've got to create the courses. You decide. So we took it underneath some chairs yesterday. We were racing and the dogs were walking in the background. It's really, I just think it's cool. My uh, kids and I had a fun time playing this last night. And even night. when he set it up in the studio this morning, he just lit up like a little kid. <laughs> I, for it was once, fun to watch. First time in months. <laughs> 2020 has been a year and all of a sudden uh, Mario Kart just takes me to where well, I want to be. Well, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm glad we can give you this distraction away from <laughs> us to keep you happy, Carrie. I'm just going to go back to playing my games if you don't mind. All right, cool. cool. I'll take the newscast from All here. Right. You just sit back and have See fun. You, Megan. <laughs> <laughs>